Well, here's post band switch where I put in the aluminum band switch rod, got rid of the fiberglass rod, destroyed the um, HF oscillator selection switch in the front of the unit, which is right about there. However, I didn't destroy all the switch. I uh, I knocked out this little part here, it got destroyed. Not sure what that does, and there's no way that's gonna go back in, I don't think. But it looks like my band four is still operational. I still have control on band four. Band five might be working too. So heck, hallelujah, this thing is still having a chance at, at entertaining me, so. It seems like it's working. I. I, I think this spectrum generator is is flaky. It seems like it doesn't always come on, but I'm not sure about that yet. Anyway, I can just cruise through here now and it works pretty good. And I'm watching the uh, scope up here and Spectrum analyzer, or spectrum on on SD on, on RTL SDR SDR um, monitoring software called Cubic SDR, and if I now twiddle with the synthesizer, you'll see that it'll start scanning. So there, it's out of lock. It's scanning for a lock. It's scanning for something that'll be f that'll make the IFs go to 4.75, and then when I lock on the 11 here there's audio so that's how it should work so for each of these you should have some some lock 10 and a half they're locked you can tell it's not searching anymore so it's locking there's some audio a little bit So yeah, that's working for now. Let's go to 10. There's 10 right there, it's locked. I don't hear anything. There's 10, okay, come on. So it's locked, but it's not letting audio through. So I gotta adjust that muting circuit. It's not, it's a little too greedy. I'm locked, but I mean, there, there it is. So at any rate, So yeah, there's some stuff on here. Pretty cool when it works. I love how it tunes when it works. Yeah, everything's kind of hack shackle weird here, so. Speaker died or something here quit. Oh, I lost sync. That's nice. It says I'm synced, but I lost audio here. I'm still synced because it's not walking around looking for there. Now it's unsynced. And now it's synced. Seems like the muting is a little greedy, so I gotta fix the muting. It doesn't seem to have a lot of favoritism there. Anyway. So it's 
So that's working. So now I should be able to go to 15. Let's see if that'll work. There's 15. Take this to 15. I want to work in this thing, right? Let's screw around. Yeah. So that's working pretty ducky now. I don't think there's anything at 20 right now. At any rate, yeah, for now it's working. Seems to work a little better with the aluminum band switch thing. Well, I cleaned the contacts like crazy in all the switches today, so maybe that helped. But I busted the one. So there's no 20 there. Oh, there's something coming in. Maybe that's 20 right there. Might be. Okay, so does this fan work? I don't think it does. I've never had that fan working. Never had it working. So that one starts at what? Starts at 20. So what are we on now? Starts at 20. Well, let's... Let's try 29. That's never going to work. Let's see if it'll work. 29, right about there. Volume up. Actually, it's not walking around, but I think that thing has a low frequency. Let's see, is it walking around? No, it's not walking around. It might be synced up there. I don't see the... Uh, no, I don't see it walking around. Son of a gun. Let's see if we can unsync it here. So the HF oscillator should be looking for a lock up there, unless I broke it. But I think the HF oscillator is working up there. I'm not sure where it is on that band. Is it way up there? I don't know. Oh, I gotta turn this too. Click, there we go. Always forget to turn that. I don't see it seeking, so, oh, there's, no, there's something. Is that my radio? No, it's not. Well, I could look in the manual and see where it's supposed to be, right? Quit being lazy. So the HF oscillator could be broken up here because I broke the switch. So maybe this doesn't have any oscillation at all all over. I think it did. At any rate. So where's that one supposed to be? If I could find the manual here and find the chart for that. Where's the chart? There's a chart. So which is that? that is. Let's go down to something low. Let's go 25. 25 is going to be what? 25 is going to be 28.75. So around 28.75 is where the oscillator should be. The HF oscillator is 28.75. 2875. 28.75 is where it should be scanning. 28.75, let's go like this. There, yeah, 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 it's scanning right there. So, yeah, it's not linked, it's not locked, so. 
but it is oscillating, so that's good. All right, now, what if we just twiddle with it? Can we lock it? No, it doesn't look like it. I don't see any lock going on. Anywhere. So, not enough signal, huh? Where else this isn't quite right? Let's see. Like that. Well, it doesn't surprise me, but you can't have everything in life. All right, what if we go down to a low on 20 or so? There's 20 right there. That. Let's go down here. Okay, where does 20 live? 20 lives 20 20 20 That's going to be 23.25 on the HF 23.25 Yeah, it's scanning, so it didn't lock. So yeah, we're not gonna get lock on this band at all. Why is that? Whoops, wrong one. There's 20 right there, okay. Come on, lock. No, it's not going to do it. So, hard to say why. Probably levels. You need to get levels more perfect. You can look at these harmonics. Where is the harmonic for this one going to be? This one wants a harmonic of on 20... It wants 28 for a harmonic. You see the 28 there on the right? It wants 28. So let's see if we go to 28 on the uh, RTLSDR service monitor thing I have here. 28, four, five, six, seven, eight. So now we should see these spikes are pretty low. So I should see some higher spikes out of this little bugger here. Let's turn this wheel and try and get some high spikes out of it. That's what we need. We need something to uh, beat against. No, it's not going to give me anything. So 28 out of this thing is just not happening. And that's probably why it doesn't work. This unit, it, whoops, let's power the radio out. It's on. Yeah, this unit is not working on that. Whoops, it's not working on that band, I don't think. I should see some pretty good stuff on 28. I don't see a thing. So that's going to kill that band off. Sheesh. All right, so what other bands? I know that this band is not going to work because I blew out the switch. But what about this one here? Broadcast band. We'll take the switch down and then over a bit. Now, that one's going to be what? I think I had that working yesterday, but I might have broken the switch. Well, it's working. 
that still works, son of a gun. It just, it just popped on the audio here. So 15's working. Well, some things still work. Come on. It was working. There it is. So we're at, I thought it's 1.5. We're not at 1.5. Looks like we're at 1-1. One, one. You can tell by the uh, pre-selector where you've synced into, usually. Okay. So you'd think that'd be 15, 1.5, but... Looks to be 1. So... That should give us some AM, I would think. It's not very stable, is it? Come on. Okay. Sounds like I am. Should get some more stations though. It's not working too well. Nothing up there. Oh, actually, that should be going. I should go down from that. It's 15, so stations would be downward from that. That's why I don't hear anything. But it should say 15 here in the dial. And it doesn't, so that's wrong. So that's all screwed up. What if we go down here a bit? Down to one and below that a bit. There's two going up. Let's go down. Let's go down here. Well, at least it does something. Oh, okay, that's this band. No wonder I'm screwed up. That's band two. Okay, 15 was working. Can I get two? Come on. Nope, no two. So we got 15, but no two. How about 2.5? Nope, so we're only gonna get 15 there. Okay, and this is band two. So this is marking in at what? It says 3 0 for band two. Seems high. That could be 3 0. That probably is 3 0. That probably is 3-0. Then I'll go to 4-0, so... Let's see, it probably is 3-0, which is all mistuned. That's way off, huh? So 1.5... 2... So that's way off. And maybe I'll my screwing around and change that. So we're at three. So that means I screwed up that band. Probably by messing around with the capacitors. I don't know, I gotta fix that. All right, so it's dead. Let's look at this band here. Will this one work at all? Zero. Let's go to one. Change this all the way to one side. There it is. 
All right, will this go? Doubt it, probably broke it. Nope. It's probably broken. It's not gonna go. All right, sanity check. What still works? Not much. I'm probably about where I was yesterday. And worse. So this band works, we know that. But you gotta wiggle the switch. There it is. We're on 14.5. Oh, that's 20 meters, isn't it? 14.5. 14.5, right about there. It's not picking up anything. Tune it. 14.0. Wiggle the switch. Tune it. Oh, gotta change this. Damn it all. Okay, like about there. Alright, let's try it now. 14 0. Right about there. And it's working. So that's 20 meters. We should get FT8 at 074. It's pretty good. How about the calibrator? One, two, three. That's pretty much right on. Let's try to calibrate. Let's see, calibrate. works or 20 meters works damn switch there it is So the receiver probably is tuned up to uh, really perform well, but I've been working on just getting the bands to work. I'm not sure how I'm going to fix that switch. Anyway, it's fun to use this thing. It's fun to tune it. Good audio. So it jumps out a lot, that's no fun.
I broke it. Doesn't like that, does it? That's pretty new. Probably too narrow for sideband 2.5. Okay. Gee, it knocks it right out. predictable. So I think that unsyncs it because it jumps the IF or something, I don't know. <laughs> There's some people on here, are we? So that's about it. I can't do 80 meters because it doesn't work. There's 80 about there. Take this thing down to 80. 80 would be like number, what, two. Probably about there, click, click. But I know this doesn't work at all. Okay, what now? Find something to do here. Okay, that's two, that's one. I wanna to go to 80 meters. Whoa, something came in. Okay, we know one works. And one, I think is three, because it's screwed up. Let's see. Which means that would be 80 meters. Okay. I hear some broadcast in there or something. So that's saying I'm right around three. Anyway, 
guess I'm not going to get anything higher than 1.5. What about 2.0? I just won't go. For whatever reason. And I don't see anything on my. I think this thing is high frequency. Well, that's about it. It's time for uh, some rest. So this thing's partially working, but. It needs a lot more work. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.